Hi everyone, we're going to determine whether the sequence is convergent or divergent. If it's convergent, we're going to find its limit. So for our function, uh, we're going to go ahead and let f of x, we're going to use uh, L'Hopital's rule, so let f of x equals ln of x divided by square root of x, and then that means uh, for our domain, x has to be positive because you can't divide by zero and we have a square root so basically the limit as x approaches infinity of f of x is going to equal the limit as x approaches infinity of ln of x divided by square root of x now applying L'Hopital's rule the derivative, uh, we're doing, taking the derivative of the numerator, which is 1 divided by x. So let's go ahead and write the limit thing first. The limit as x approaches infinity, we're going to get the derivative of ln of x is 1 divided by x. And the derivative of the denominator is going to be 1 divided by 2 square root of x. All right, so simplifying this, we're going to get um, uh, the limit as x approaches infinity. And this is uh, simplifying this part. This is 1 divided by x times 2 um, square root of x. So this gives you 2 uh, x to the 1 half power divided by x. So this ends up being um, 2x to the 1 half power minus 1. So that's minus 2 half. So basically you're going to get the limit of uh, 2 divided by square root of x. So this is going to be x to the negative 1 half power there. All right. Now as you apply this limit, this is going to go to 0. As this number gets larger and larger, um, the denominator is larger than the numerator, so it gets closer and closer to zero. So our sequence a sub n converges, and you can write the limit as n approaches infinity of a sub n equals zero. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.